what's going on everybody I'm Mustachi and today I'm just going to quickly show you how to download Rust for free and that's with online so you can play online with your friends and whatnot so first of all you're going to go to this link right here it would be in the description so don't worry about that just head over there so we're just going to go over here and it's called Mega you're going to need Google Chrome to go on Mega so just download Google Chrome so once you're on Mega just there'll be a big red button here that says download you just want to click on that and it's only 500 megabytes so it won't take that long so once that's downloading you want to go to the second link which is this one right here um, that'll be in the description as well so I'm just going to quickly copy and we'll head over to the link So pretty much as soon as you get onto the the website, it'll download straight away. As you can see, it's done that. So uh, actually, it doesn't really matter where it goes. You don't really need it. So once that's done, you're gonna need WinRAR as well. So if you don't have WinRAR, the link is right there. Um, yeah, I'll show you how to get that as well. So copy. <coughs> Just open up a new tab and straight away it downloads because I already have it. I'm just going to quickly cancel that so I don't have two. So, yeah, I'll be back when this hits 100%. So, once it's gone to 100%, once it's fully finished downloading, you'll get this little thing down the bottom on Google Chrome. You just want to click show in folder and then you also want to get uh, the folder that you're putting in. The, uh, the rust in, you just want to drag it over like that so you just exit that, just minimize and then uh, all you want to do is just right click on it just right click and you want to ex click extract files and then um, if it's not already set to the place you want it to go to uh, just find it so I'm going to put it in actually not there um, put it in my Rust folder there so I'm going to click OK and then just let it extract so once your window is finished uh, extracting you just find your Rust folder click on Rust and then you want to click on Luma EMU once you've done that, you just want to get rid of the player name and put whatever you want. So I'm just going to make it Hi Musashi. And then just change the player nickname as well. So I'm Mustashi. Um, you can change your clan tag name and all that if you want as well but that's uh, up to you I'm just gonna get rid of these because they probably won't let me uh, put it in like most games so once you've done that just click save exit just open it back up and make sure it's, yep, it's there and then just click so once you've changed your player name, you just want to double click on Rust and then just uh, make the resolution whatever you want. I'm just going to put it down to that and then just the graphics quality and I'm just going to put it to uh, good. Actually, I'll put it to simple. You just click play and it's just going to come up with this face for a while. We just want to, it's just kind of loading so you just want So once it's finished loading, you just want to press uh, F1 and then it'll come up with this and I'm going to have, uh, I'll just quickly open this for you guys. These are um, some of the servers that you can connect to, so I'm going to put them in the description and all you do is you just uh, copy the whole thing, like copy uh, net.com, close it and then just put it down there, uh, paste it and then just click enter. And then to get rid of that, just press F1 again. And then just let it load. So that's pretty much it.